Hello and welcome to uh, Square Tree Gaming. It's just me today, Tim. Uh, I thought I'd mix it up a bit, playing a game called The Binding of Isaac. It's an indie game, and I think we've got some backstory here. Isaac and his mother lived alone in a small house on a hill. Isaac kept to himself, drawing pictures and playing with his toys as his mom watched Christian broadcasts on the television. Life was simple, and they were both happy. That was until the day Isaac's mom heard a voice from above. Your son has become corrupted by sin. He needs to be saved. I will do my best to save him, my lord, Isaac's mother replied, rushing into Isaac's room, removing all that was evil from his life. Again, the voice called to her. Isaac's soul is still corrupt. He needs to be cut off from all that is evil in this world and confess his sins. I will follow your instructions, Lord. I have faith in thee, Isaac's mother replied as she locked Isaac in his room away from the evils of the world. One last time, Isaac's mom heard the voice of God calling to her. You've done as I'd asked, but I still question your devotion to me to prove your faith. I will ask one more thing of you. Yes, Lord, anything, Isaac's mother begged. To prove your love and devotion, I require a sacrifice. Your son, Isaac, will be this sacrifice. Go into his room and end his life as an offering to me to prove you love me above all else. Yes, Lord, she replied, grabbing a butcher's knife from the kitchen. Isaac, watching through a crack in his door, trembled in fear. Scrambling around his room to find a hiding place, he noticed a trap door to the basement hidden under his rug. Without hesitation, he flung open the hatch, just as his mother burst through his door and threw himself down into the unknown depths below. Alright, so it's quite a messed up backstory there. Um, you're playing as little Isaac, who's very religious mum. Um, tried to kill him, apparently, but uh, he just escaped into the, the basement, and it seems you can unlock characters I found here, um, anyway, we'll go ahead and play it, I guess we have to play as Isaac, <laughs> so I think it's, it, the game's sort of like, a, similar to Minecraft in the, in the sense that you've got uh, all of these little du dungeony things, uh, are completely rege um, randomly generated. <laughs> so, uh, ooh, what the heck, what's going on here? So you never get the same world twice. <laughs> it's quite an addictive game. I'm not too sure what I'm doing. I think I have to just kill these people. But this is the, uh, the people that made uh, Super Meat Boy. They also made this. Just in there, they had some, a couple of spare weeks at home. They just make this, which is kind of crazy. But it's quite an addictive game. All right. Oh, and occasionally you come up against uh, monsters that sort of appear in his in his, in his fears things. And this is a crazy monster. Where's he gone? Whoa. Oh, I died. Great start. Alright, let's try again. Oh, wow. What did I get? Ten bombs. Okay. Drop one. Yeah. Alright, whoa. Alright, so I suppose this is like a little review of the game. But it's 
quite good at the minute. Not as you saw, not very easy. As I died pretty much instantly. But I suppose the more you play it, the more you get used to it. Oh. I bet these are like the low level easy enemies I'm sucking at. Yeah. Oh, double. So like as you can see here, uh, every dungeon's different with different rock patterns. Oh, coming up a different enemy now. Whoa, what the hell? Whoa. Ah! Oh god. And you can see his his health bar at the top there. Sort of about halfway at the minute. He seems to progressively fall asleep every now and again. I don't know if I'm causing that or if he just falls asleep. There he goes again. Oh, I'm gonna die again. Oh god, what the hell? This little minion's attacking me now. Ah, uh, uh, right. He, he's not even dead. Come on. There we go. Alright, what's this? I've got life from it and some dessert I got. Don't know what that does. Drop down here. Oh. Oh. Let's have my pants pulled down. Very mature. Um I'm not sure what's going on. Although instead of having a three life limit now I've got four lives. Which I seem to be like upgrading almost as I go through the levels. Once again it's a different Ooh, pattern. Uh, not an easy game. Oh. These are weird, they're just like heads these enemies. Oh, come on. Come on. There we go. Oh, I've got another light. Yay. Whoa. Whoa. What are these things? Okay. Sort of drop lots of bombs. It's a tactic. That didn't work. There. No, he's running away from it. Oh, come on. Get him. Oh, I died again. Wow. I was killed by this thing in the, some basement. I gave all I own to my cat, Guppy. It's not a very uh, formal game, as you can see. It's quite relaxed and fun. What's behind these? Nothing. Oh. Great use. Great use. Alright. Whoa, lots of headless ones. <laughs> See where the bodies are of the headless ones earlier then. Uh, my life seemed to have reset when, when you die as well. So I only have three lives now. Ooh, what's that? Got a key. Whoa. Lots of these things are bees, wasps, horrible things. Is that one gonna hit me? Yeah. Oh. You, uh, you can only shoot like uh, up, down, left, right, as you can probably see. Hence why I'm trying to get onto the like the same grid as him. Whoop. Which isn't very easy when they're constantly firing back at you. Oh. Hey, what's that? Half a life and some money. Go into this yellow room. Chocolate milk? Oh, yeah. Okay, right. Moving on. I'm not sure what those arrows mean. It says. Oh! Oh dear. Oh no. What is this, dude? Ah! 
Oh, I see. That chocolate milk I picked up sort of changed the colour of the balls I fire. The arrows. Now they're chocolate milk I'm firing at him. Okay, this is a... don't know if you can hear my keyboard now, but I'm bashing it quite hard. Come on. Come on. Where's he gone? Alright. Oh. He's not the prettiest of uh, bosses I've come up against, but... Come on. Nearly got him now. Ah! Back down to half a life of health. How am I going to do it? Oh, I've got some good hits in there. Ah! Ah! Yeah. Jumping on the top of me. There we go. That's got him. The belt. Oh, I see. I've upgraded my little character. He's got a belt now. Ah. Oh, more health. 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 Oh, all right. That must do in one of my uh, dreams. I have. Or well, not dreams. Fears almost. Alright, oh, can we get to that chest? How do I get to that chest? I don't think I can. Can't get to that key either. Just destroy one of these. I don't have any bombs. Oh well, just have to ignore them. Oh boy. Ah! Uh, what the hell? These things are like popcorn on legs. That's ridiculous. Quite imaginative from the, the designers here, but ridiculous. Oh, these things don't just seem to do much. It's friendly popcorns. Whoa, no, they're not. Oh, definitely not. A popcorn that drops bees. All right, carry on. Oh boy. What did I get? Some hearts and a bomb. Oh, Larry Jr. Oh boy. Oh no, it's a huge worm. No, it's two huge worms. Ah! Oh, crap. How am I supposed to get him? Oh, come on. Is he running? He's almost running away from me now. Come on. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> Seems to just run in random directions. He's not actually coming after me. Oh, oh, there's a good hit. Ah. <laughs> he lays poo as he goes along, it seems, then picks it up again. No, he just ate some. Yeah. Whoa. Is that a good thing? A radioactive spider. I'm very confused. Oh, I see. We're in the caves now. Past the basements. Oh, caves. How do I get to him? Can I? No, I can't save him. Sorry. There's another one. I can't go over there. How do you... I don't think you can jump in there. Sorry, Frank. Can't shoot me either. Sorry. Now we got some Oh, more... Different enemies again. Lots of different enemies in this game. And I think... I this, The... The regenerative... Uh, uh, the randomly generated uh, dungeons are quite good as well. It always keeps you... Uh, Unexpected things appearing. Oh, I've just just noticed now. There's like a map at the the top left there. Huh. I guess that's one of these ways shows me the way out or something to the next boss. Let's see which. Whoa, more of them. Ah. Whoa. 
That was amazing. Ah! Whoa! What? 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 How are you meant to avoid these things? Oh, and I'm dead already. I was killed by this thing in some cave. Huh. Alright, let's go again. Is this right back at the beginning again? Oh, I've lost my pants as well. Pills. Oh boy. Just blew the heads off these ones. What? It's nuts. Alright, let's go through the yellow gate. Oh, fuck. Oh, I got an extra life. Whoa, it's like attached itself to me. What? Oh, I have to play Larry Jr. again. This kid again. Although, once again, it's a different, different layout. See, I've, oh, I've got a bomb. Oh, whoops, didn't mean to. Oh, damage myself. seem to get a hit on him. Come on. Die, Larry. Oh, man. Is he doing so much damage? The random direction of these things really doesn't help when you're trying to kill it, so either. Oh. What is it doing? It's just going backwards and forwards. Oh, they're nearly dead. He's nearly dead. Come on, Larry. It's your time to die now. Oh, man. No. He's laying lots of poo this time. Come on, Larry. Come on, Larry. Come to Tim. Yeah. Boy, what's that? Mum's lipstick. Oh man! Put it on my lips! Oh, that's not a good look. Alright, now we're down in the caves again. Oh, right. Oh, I've just. What does that do? <laughs> Telly pills! Oh wow, awesome. Let's use that pill I picked up earlier taking me to a random part of the uh, this stage on the caves. Whoa! Whoa! I'm dead again. Yeah. Oh, you seem to die a lot in this game. Ah, oh, wow. I'm not getting double B now. Wow. Oh, that's it, right, I'm, right. Anyway, that was me messing around on a bit of bi Binding of Isaac. It's a good game, good game. Recommend you all go buy it. It's only like a couple of pounds on Steam. Um, yeah, here's the guys that made it. Thank you. Great game, great game.